Well, after a disappointing Carabao Cup exit on penalties on Tuesday night, the focus is now very much on Premier League points for Everton. Still to get off the mark this season, despite being in front in each of their last two league games, the pressure is building. And this afternoon's encounter here at Leicester, promoted back to the top flight this season, is a huge opportunity for Everton to get their campaign up and running. Ready to go at the King Power Stadium. Everton are unbeaten in each of their last three visits here. And we all know how much the three points will mean today if they can finally secure that first win of the season. Ball back with Acoli, the Italian defender brought in in the summer. Here's uh, Wout Fess, the Belgian. Leicester operating a similar system to Everton. Coley on the ball at the moment, here's Fass. Going long, inevitably, for Jamie Vardy. Ashley Young is operating at left-back for Everton today. That's well run by Dominic Calvert-Lewin. Flagged offside. And die for McNeil. Well, that's great. Neat feet from Dwight McNeil. Iliman and Dai turning away and delivering a great ball into the penalty area. What a big chance early on for Lindstrom. Volleyed wide. That was wonderful work down the left between McNeil initially and then Iliman and Dai. Not quite the finish. Brilliant play between McNeil. And then die, and that's a quality cross over the head of Calvert Lewin. Lindstrom couldn't steer it. One here. Calvert Lewin picking up. Lindstrom, McNeil. Here's Young. Die. He's got the free kick. Prepared to take people on as always. Lindstrom or McNeil. It is Lindstrom who goes for goal right into the defensive wall, which stood firm. Mangala plays it out wide for. Iliman and Dai, who won the free kick in the first instance. Here's Young, back into Andai, it's a great ball as well. Great feet, great finish, brilliantly done for his first Premier League goal. Quality from Iliman and Dai. Superb football. He's full of trickery. And he delivers the goods. Early on here at the King Power Stadium. Everton. Young's ball was quality. And Dai did the rest. Picked his spot. What an accurate strike this is. His first Premier League goal for Everton. To add to the one that he delivered in the League Cup last month. Everton have a lead again in the Premier League. Here's Mangala. That's a decent ball out wide for Jasper Lindstrom. Lindstrom, Calvert-Lewin turns, gets his shot away. Lindstrom likewise. Blocked by goalkeeper Hermanson. Well struck by Jasper Lindstrom after Calvert-Lewin saw his effort initially blocked. The wide ball was a decent one. Calvert-Lewin with the first effort. Visibility not so great now either. Here's McNeil, Mangala. Young 
progressing, delivering. Away by Akoli. Mangala feeds it for Lindstrom. Chance for Everton. And Lindstrom lifts it over. He's had opportunities. And he got right underneath that one. But Everton continue to press and look for the second goal. Underneath it, Jasper Lindstrom on his first Premier League start. Worked it onto that right foot. Everton get the block, preventing the ball coming into the penalty area. And Illiman and Dye is off, holding off all comers and doing brilliantly for Everton to bring in Dwight McNeil. And he can have a crack at goal from here, he does, but he drags it well wide. He claims it took a touch off the Leicester player. Illiman and Dye did very well. McNeil in space. Positioned himself, but with his shot wide of goal. And a crack of thunder sounds as the half time whistle does too. The stormy affair in terms of matters off the pitch, the rain relentless, flashes of lightning, and Everton's flash from Illiman and Dai delivered a wonderful goal. In the 12th minute of this game, a well-worked Everton opener. Lindstrom had a chance as well, but Everton have the half-time advantage. It's been a very, very wet affair indeed. Trying to see if the thunder and lightning would subside. The rain is still falling here at uh, the King Power Stadium, but we are getting underway for the second half as the uh, terrible conditions persist. Importantly, Everton have the one-goal advantage and will try and look to add to it and take the three points for the first time this season. Everton attacking from left to right as we look in the second half. Not well worked. Lindstrom for McNeil. Calvert-Lewin outside of him is Undai. Calvert-Lewin just can't squeeze it through to him, but it is picked up by Undai now. Illiman Undai with those bits of trickery inside the penalty area, almost resulting in a, an effort to trouble the goalkeeper, but not so. Lifted high and wide in the end by Illiman Undai. But again, showing what he's about. Christensen for Mavididi. He's gone past uh, Garner, Mavadidi. Back into the penalty area when Undai managed to meet it and does very well into the path of McNeil. Undai continues his run. McNeil powering forward and playing a great ball through for Calvert-Lewin. Brilliant strike, excellent save to Everton. Very, very close to a two-goal lead. Oh. This was Everton's break earlier. Superb ball from McNeil to Calvert-Lewin. Good strike and a decent save too. Calvert-Lewin going for placement, really. Corner played centrally into the danger zone and smashed home. Steffi Mavididi claiming it, hit it into the ground and up and over the defender and into the roof of the net. Everton getting men behind the ball in numbers. Determined to see this one through and claim their first Premier League points of the campaign. Winks has overhit that one again and that should be it. The referee will have a final look at his watch. The four minutes of stoppage time are up on mine. And it is all square at the King Power Stadium and Everton do pick up their first Premier League point of the season. It's full time at the King Power Stadium. It's Leicester 1, Everton 1.